Submission of the night goes to Clay Guida. Uh, knockout of the night, Jeremy Stevens. Fight of the night, Frankie Edgar and Gray Maynard. And also just wanted to point out, Dana wanted to point out that uh, both fighters in the main event will get their win bonuses for the draw. So we're gonna open up for questions. He could have waited for a big level fight. He's a true fighter, true warrior. And he gave me my opportunity, so I had to thank him first. And uh, their keys, I, I have great coaches, the best coaches in the world. And it was angles, it was movement. Chris gets frustrated with fighters who move and don't stand right in front of him. And uh, we knew that he could be attacked to the body. And I think the attacks to the body, the kicks to the body are what really set up the knockout. Um, the key in this fight, in, the, in our training, was to not get punched by Gomi too much. Obviously, I got a few scuffs and you know bumps and bruises, but I feel good. Um, he's a he's a mo uh, momentum fighter. You know, very like Chris Lieben. He loves when guys stand in his range. You want to get in trading wars with him. That's not what I wanted to do. Um, I got it. You know, for a second, I thought I landed a couple good shots. I kicked him in the face, and I saw him take a big, you know, deep breath in the you know first round. And uh, it kind of brought me back to when he fought um, Nick Diaz. You know, you could see him getting winded, and I just took over. We got that takedown finally. He's got good wrestling. He stuffed a couple of my shots, but once I got that single leg and picked him up, I think he kind of knew the you know the end was near. So second round, he uh, rung my bell real quick, and then um, I got back to my wrestling, opened up uh, my ground and pound for that submission. That kind of told the tale. His uh, original plan was to stay with them and take him down after you know a couple punches, you know, but then. Nate kind of knew that he was gonna, you know, tackle him down, you know, take him, uh, take him to, uh, down to the ground. So he he was kind of worried about, you know, being taken down, so, you know, taken down. So it, it it didn't go how he expected at first, but you know everything was fine. Yeah, you know, I got hit with a big shot. He came out strong, did a good job, but I bounced back. You know, I felt I won the last four rounds. Um, it was a great fight. It was exciting. You know, for me, for the fans, win win. Jump in and just tell you that the, the other thing that Dana mentioned is that Anthony Pettis will get the next title shot. No, I don't want a loss. I mean, you know, I want, I want the belt. Um, I want draws a draw. I thought I, I thought that was my fight. Um, you know, six million. You know, I thought I had that. I thought the belt was mine. <clears throat> um. You know, and this, this is with the utmost respect. Again, like Chris Liebman, uh, I'm fighting in the house that, that guys like Chris Liebman and Vanderlei Silva built. You know, guys like Frankie and Gray, those kind of fights. Uh, I, I think I'd like to fight Vanderlei next. He's been a guy who I've watched for years before I ever put a glove on. Um, I mean, he's amazing. And, and I want to, and, and he's as tough as they come, he's as good as they come. He's, you know, multiple weight champion. I think I'd like to fight him next. Uh, but I'll be prepared for anybody. Uh, you know, Gray is a phenomenal wrestler. Um, <clears throat> I've, I've been seeing Gray wrestle since the college days, but, uh, you know, I believe in my wrestling too. I think I have pretty, uh, pretty good wrestling myself. So uh, I was able to capitalize and get some takedowns of my own. Um, I'm very fortunate to have the best fans in the world in the UFC, and they're always behind me, which is great. I would hate to be on the other end of this spectrum, you know, which could happen overnight. I try to block those guys out. I could hear my cornerman, my brother Jason, um, Mike Winklejohn and Greg Jackson in there very clearly, and that's all I focused on. And um, we surprised him with that head kick, and I think that opened up a lot in the fight. It opened up my wrestling.